how are you? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? Good. I'm doing amazing. Congratulations Thank on you. your nomination. Thank you. You're the behind the scenes director of Beyond yeah. Utopia. Yes. Well, <laughs> this is my, this is the most grand red, this is the, I, I think, um, this is the most grand red carpet I've ever been a part of. So it's, it's quite something. Yeah. Yeah. The most grand, uh, the grandest, I should say. Um, no, it's amazing. It's, 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 it's such an honor to be here. And, you know, I, um, I have such reverence for the DGA. And so to have gotten this nomination was such a surprise and such an honor. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited and appreciative and it's amazing to be around so many amazing directors, so many amazing filmmakers. So, yeah. Who are two directors who you feel personally paved the way, you know, for directors such as yourself and other ones that will soon be coming behind you? You know, who are two directors that have already paved the way? Oh my God, there's so many amazing directors and I have worked with a lot of them because I, I, I directed this film and edited it, but I've actually been an editor a lot of my life. And so I'm gonna, I'm gonna call out two uh, directors who I have worked with, um, Reed Morano and Julius Ona. And there are many others, uh, Jacob Aronestes, Jonathan Nossiter. I mean, these are just people who I've worked with. Of course, I have so many who I admire who I've not worked with, but these are people I've worked with who I have such incredible respect and admiration for, so. Yeah. Madeline, before I let you go, what would a win tonight mean to you? Oh, God, I mean, <laughs> it would mean so much on so many levels. Um, first off, as, you know, to be honored by the DGA, as someone who has, I've only directed two films. I've been an editor, as I said, most of my career, so I've directed two films. That would be incredible right there. Um, and then, because the topic of our film is really about bring, giving voice to people of North Korea, you know, people who have not had any voice in our media in the United States. And so this win, if, if we were to win, which, you know, would be, I feel like it would help to bring those voices forward, which is the whole point of making this movie. So, yeah. Not if you win, when you win. Listen, my fingers are crossed for you, okay? I look forward to seeing you, you so on the much. inside. Thank you. Thank you.